Okay, so I thought I would do a super quick outfit of the day um, and give you a little tour of the difference between vintage sizes and modern vanity sizes and why I prefer to buy and wear vintage clothing when I can. I'm working on rebuilding my wardrobe, but... Um, so I have a Chessa Davis maxi skirt, and you can find Chessa Davis skirts online, sometimes on eBay. I got this one at a local vintage store, I think it was $18, maybe. Um, so this doesn't have a size, and for me it's a little too big. In the waist and hips um, but it comes with this belt and so the way that I had styled it today is to just take the belt and tie the belt around my natural waist and then I just have this crappy um, long sleeve Mosmo supply shirt from Target um, that the color kind of matches with um, it used to have can you kind of see the turquoise color in there? I used to have a, a turquoise shirt um, that was Arizona Company from JCPenney that I would wear with this. Don't really have a lot of stuff that matches with it. And then I have a, what I wore with it today is this Charter Club jacket. Um, and Charter Club, you can get at Macy's. Um, they're all right for an inexpensive clothing brand. Um, they're kind of like most most supply company because their their sizing is pretty good, and they're for a little bit they're a little bit younger styled. I think Charter Club's a little bit older styled, and the reason I don't like this jacket is like I think this is. I have to check. It's either an extra large or a 16, and I need that. If I move this up a little bit, I need that for my shoulders because I'm just a giant Amazonian. You know, I could stand to lose maybe 15 pounds, but I really think the jacket makes me look heavier because <laughs> if you look at what I would prefer in the waist, and I suppose if I wanted to spend twice as much as I paid for the actual jacket itself, I think, you know, the original price of the jacket was $60, and I got this in uh, about two years ago, in 2009, and I think I paid maybe 20 or 25 for it. Look at, at how much really smaller I would need it to be fit in the waist. Also, check out how kind of short the sleeves are on this. So it doesn't really fit me, and it's really impossible to find stuff that fits me. Even with the vintage sizing, I would be more likely to find something that fits in the shoulders and in the waist, but the sleeves would probably still be too short. So... And then, of course, I'm always just going to default to the calico apron when I'm at home. Alright, so that was my super quick outfit of the day. And, um, yeah. <laughs> See, if you can, if you've ever worn a Chessa Davis maxi skirt, then video, post a video response to this um, video. I think they're kind of hard to pull off in public, but I just love them so much, so. Um, the boho thing's kind of in right now, and I'd love to see people wearing them. 